many times what you will see is young people get scholarships in their mm -hmm. freshman year. Mm -hmm. Everybody's giving them something, right. okay, which I'm happy to see. But what we saw was a need between the junior year and senior yes. year. And what was happening was like you'd get kids who would come and they would say, I'm going to have to drop out. Mm. Oh, I'm going to have to take a job. Well, the thing that we worried about was if they dropped out, took a job, they may or may not come back. So what we said was, let's look at, on a need basis, how can we keep them in school? Don't bridge the gap. The dean, Dean Nelson, School of um, Graduate School of Business at Bowie State, along with uh, people at Gramlin and Your alma Howard. Mama. Yes, <laughs> my wife's uh, trustee at Bethune Cookman, and we had a young lady there. She was short six to eight hundred dollars, and was going to have to drop out. Mm. So they called us to say, "Can you help?" Well, naturally, we stepped Wonderful. up because for us, she was too close. Mm -hmm. Another young lady we had at Spelman, and um, uh, mom and dad were incarcerated, and this young lady was just truly doing an outstanding job. We followed her all the way through Spelman, and um, I, I never will forget. I went down for her graduation, and Wonderful. mom was, um, had gotten out of prison, mm -hmm. and. Uh, Mom came to us and said, thank you so much for helping our daughter. And the young lady said, I really want to go to law school. And so we said, well, if you get into law school, mm -hmm. we will follow you and we will help. Wonderful. She's now at the uh, third year at the University of Maryland Law School. Great. Doing an outstanding job. She'll be graduating here shortly. Excellent. And she's going to be an outstanding lawyer. 